And tomorrow, the Brownsville flea market will reopen after five months of being closed. CBS4's Gabby Moreno spoke to vendors and visited the market as they prepare to open their doors. The weekend of March 14th and 15th was the last time the 77 flea market in Brownsville was open for business. With no word on when it would reopen, vendors struggled to stay positive. For the past three years, Claudia Barraza has spent her weekend selling artisan pottery. It's not the same being at home, being able to share, see people, talk, and I think that's what's most exciting for me. The market seems like a ghost town compared to how it looked before the pandemic. Tomorrow, vendors will once again be allowed to fill these empty tables, but some of them are choosing not to come back. Maria Lopez and her husband came to the market today to tear down their stand. After 10 years, the couple decided they would no longer sell. Diabetes, blood pressure, thyroid, and who knows what else. That's why I can't come anymore. I can't get COVID. The market will not operate the same way tomorrow. Market manager Juani Parra explains they have been working very closely with the city of Brownsville to plan a successful reopening. So we want everybody's help so this can be a, a great day tomorrow for everybody. For many vendors, this will be the first opportunity to try and make money after preparing to open July 4th weekend and not being able to. They, they live off, uh, you know, what, what they sell here. So when we announced that we were going to open, um, they were really excited, really excited. Working for you in Brownsville, Gaby Moreno. Well, the market is planning on closing entrances to monitor the number of people shopping. Masks will be mandatory.